Hi YouTube! So, bin cages are really good because they give you lots of room for your hamster. This one up here, for instance, which I've sat up here seems I'm packing, my new hamster loves. She's rather happy, chews on the plastic a little bit, but it's quite happy chewing on wood chews. Bitches, on the other hand, doesn't like her cage. So, over the past couple of days I've tried to deter her from chewing the plastic and it hasn't really worked. It resulted in her chewing this section here, up this section here. No sections over by her wheel. She hasn't even been bothered by her wheel. She also chewed this section. Now the next section I'm going to show you is quite funny. She chewed her way out nearly. Luckily she couldn't get past these bits here. But she did manage to throw all her stuff out. She, uh, When I found her just now, she was trying to get out this. And this, from this little hole, which might I add, her pushing on, it won't come out. So, I'm going to do a thorough clean, because this has been in the attic. A thorough clean of this, oh, of this cage here. And she's going to go back in her old cage, so I can buy her another wired one. Because, obviously, this one, she's been chewing as well. But, at least she couldn't escape from this one. And at least, better. So, at least now, if I ever have a problem with that hamster. I've got all spare nuts and bolts and wires and things for that hamster but I guess all the money that I spent on making this one bin for fidget was not been horrible, a waste of money. So if you are going to make a bin cage for your hamster please make sure your hamster doesn't love plastic um, because fidget just didn't want any of the wood shoes that I shoved in her cage or anything. So yeah. Um, Bin cages are great size wise, but if you have a plastic loving hamster, beware, they can escape. Okay?